Let's learn how uh, Microsoft Excel uh, can help us do matrix operations. Um, there's one matrix, uh, it's a 3 by 2 matrix, and here's another one, a whoops, a 2 by 2 matrix. Uh, and I want to multiply this matrix by this matrix uh, to get a resultant 3 by 2 matrix. Uh, and I'm going to show you how to do it. Uh, a little unusually, we select the whole area of the resultant matrix. The, the active cell is still uh, H2, uh, but we select the whole uh, of the uh, resultant matrix area. Then we simply type equals mmult, which is just like any old Excel function. Uh, we pop into that array 1. And we're going to multiply it by array 2. And then we close the parentheses. Now, in order that the whole of the area uh, of, the, of the resultant matrix is filled, uh, I'm not just going to press enter at this point. Uh, I'm actually going to hold down the control key. I'm also going to hold down the shift key, and then I'm going to press enter, and we can see what happens. By holding down the control and the shift key, and then pressing enter, I've asked Excel to fill in the whole resultant uh, uh, matrix for me. And uh, the, the square curly brackets give away uh, the fact that we're using a matrix operation there. But that's it. It's very easy to use. Uh, it's very easy to uh, perform matrix operations with, 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 it, with Excel. Uh, there's a lot of power included. It's easy to find the inverse of a matrix, the determinant of a matrix. And I think the difficulty that I used to have when I was uh, when I could perform matrix functions at school uh, was I couldn't couldn't necessarily see the benefit of uh, matrix operations. But there's some nice examples on the Excel Calc site. Uh, one being a, uh, a transformation matrix where we uh, 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 translate and rotate uh, a graph uh, of of Excel data. That's uh, quite an interesting example to have a look at. And the uh, other interesting use is the, when finding uh, the solution to simultaneous equations. If you search on the Excel Calc site, you can see uh, some good applications of uh, uh, matrix operations. OK, so I suggest you all just jump in, start playing around with matrices, uh, and uh, I think you'll find that they're, uh, uh, it's well worth the effort and you'll, you'll put them to very good use indeed.